I wonder if anyone in the world thought what was happening in the East when the Spice Girls were dominating. Well, this is it. Hey yo everyone, Blakesta here. And as you can see right here, and from the title down below, we're about to check out SES's Love Story. So this is definitely gonna be like the oldest group I'll be reacting to. And I just have nothing but respect for this group. I mean, SES, for those of you that don't know, K-pop's first ever girl group. They were the ones that pretty much proved to Korea that girl groups can work. I mean, without them, we probably wouldn't have any of the girl groups that we have 20 years later. And even though they broke up in 2002, they are back together for their 20th anniversary album, and they're starting us off with this SM Station track, which I actually have heard the song before because they released it as an audio before they even put it out as a video. I'm not really sure what this video was all about, but I'm guessing based on this old 90s looking, I forgot what it's called. <laughs> kind of like what, um, I don't know how to pronounce the group's name, but kind of like what they did for their comeback single. So yeah, I'm looking forward to what they have in store for their fans for their 20th anniversary. And I would just say this, if this group promotes alongside SNSD in any sort of way, that will complete my life. It's like, it's like the original legends and the current legends just together in one form. Like, I already saw the clip where Tiffany was with, I think it was Bada, and <laughs> oh, that was such a wonderful moment. But yeah, let's just get into this. Three, two, one, hit the playback. Ugh. Bada. Bada is hands down the best female vocalist that SM's ever had. Oh. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it's like old school music videos. Like that. <laughs> Man. I bet this is bringing people back. Like, this is when the Spice Girls were active, mind you. Okay, so it's just like clips of their old music videos or something like that. Which I have seen some of their older songs. I heard this is like a... Combination of like, all oh, dreams come true, that's a good song. This is like a combination of like a couple songs that they did, including their debut song, I'm Your Girl. Which... One of the best K-pop songs ever, in my opinion. None but respect for these women. Oh, is this when they're winning number one? Oh, look at all them fans. Wow. I wonder how many of those are still around today. I'm sure they're still around. A lot of them. Twilight Zone? I haven't heard that song. I've heard of a few of their songs, like... I'm Your Girl, Dreams Come True, Be Natural, which Red Velvet covered, and a couple others that I'm missing. Oh, press conferences. And I think their fandom color is purple, is that right? Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. Aw, wait. Oh, be natural. There we go. <laughs> she was good with short hair. I've seen this music video. Okay, so it's just basically a bunch of music videos. Not that I mind, though. Because they're coming out with two more music videos later. Two more original songs. So, that's definitely... Expect a reaction from those soon. Oh. 
I don't know who the rapper is, so you're gonna have to tell me that in the comments too. Uh, and then, oh, 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 here we go, here we go. Oh my goodness, I'm probably gonna hate myself when I edit this. Oh, there they are today. Oh, that is such a beautiful photo. SES. Love story. Detainment. Okay, wow. Just as good as I remember it. Wow. <coughs> and that was just plain ugly. <laughs> Alright, well, that was SES's love story. And no explanation needed. They slayed. Even though this was just a station track, I mean, you could tell that they really put their soul and their heart and soul into you know, making this song a good song for them to return to and to have their old fans remember them. And SES is coming out of a wave of like all these older groups, you know, getting back together, re-debuting. I know G.O.D. is back, Sit Skis are back, now SES is back. I heard that I think Turbo is back too, man. When's H.O.T. gonna be back? I mean, I've heard rumors of that for a long time, but wow, this is definitely a new era for these 90s groups, and I'm all in for it. I was born in 94, and I vaguely remember the 90s, but though, but for the parts of the 90s that I do remember, how I wish I had a time machine. Their voices, of course, were on point. Bada, like I said during my reaction, best female vocalist SM has ever had. And I like that the video was just like a little flashback to all those, you know, older videos, you know, music shows, music videos, and other stuff that they did, because I'm sure there are lots of fans right now that are reminiscing of, like, the good old days, and I absolutely cannot wait for their album, too. They're releasing a f their first album in, like, 15 years, like... <sighs> Yo. That's gonna be gold. Alright, so that's my opinion. What are your guys' opinions? Put it down in the comments down below, and SES, welcome back. This is Blakester. You're watching AO Blakester. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, peace out, Blake Scouts.